Well, hello, hello, creatives. Hello, everybody, and welcome to my live stream. It's Olga Sarokina here, and today we're gonna draw a oh, super stylish, like a sun, yellow Eames chair. It's really popular. <laughs> this drawing is from my previous live stream that I didn't save. Yes, so let's start all over again. So, for now, you will need a black liner. You can also need uh, a pencil, regular pencil, white pastel pencil for details at the very end. Any bright color in my case, I decided it will be yellow one. You will need also a color for the wood and maybe black marker for details. All right, and yes, I like to use this beige color. For the final detailing. So let's draw this Eames chair. So of course you will need a piece of paper and first we will outline our chair. So it will be our, our center of composition. So I will put it slightly to the right because we will have this uh, side table to the left. And first step is outlining our chair. So let's do some basic measurements, some basic forms. We are outlining this basic forms. And this chair, it is it's positioned in frontal perspective. So we are, let's assume that we are standing and watching at it. Uh, in frontal perspective. Frontal perspective means that uh, we have one vanishing point on our uh, horizon line. So here is our horizon line and let's say that we have this vanishing point here, point A, and our lines are converging right to it, to this vanishing point. So we want to draw a plane for its legs, like that. Here, quickly, let's quickly sketch this on the side table. And please notice that um, bottom oval uh, will be open a little bit more because it's far from our horizon line in comparison with the upper oval. So these are some basic rules of perspective drawing. And if you don't know yet, I have a free, complete, completely free video course on perspective basics for interior designers and interior design students. Uh, you can access it on my website, which is uh, which is olgaart888.com. So head over to my website and register. Uh, for this free video course. So we switch to coloring. Uh, I used to start with the lightest marker I have. So this one it's Tombov. It's Tombov, it's acid free. From the beginning I will show drop shadows from the chair here from the table, under the table, even from the lamp, even here. Then I switch to this yellow marker and we outline our protagonist, our main hero of this scene, of this drawing. Here we will have a yellow bottle. Also, we can add a little bit of yellow to this lamp. And I want to darken this chair here a little bit and here because it's basically it's a piece of plastic. So if you have, you guys, any questions, please don't hesitate to ask them. 
Right now I will check all your comments at the very end of this live stream. So we continue. Uh, here we have a wonderful wall, wooden wall. So we quickly sketch this wooden structure, maybe even show wooden texture. And you know, my friends, sketching, it's, it should be really quick. Don't think about sketching like it's an academic work. Don't put in too much time drawing one sketch. Don't be afraid of to do any mistakes. Mistakes, it's part of learning. So try to work on your speed in sketching. The quicker the better, <laughs> because your lines will be more dynamic. Your sketch will look much more energetic. It will look like you put some nice energy into it. So don't make this process far too long. It's not what we want here. Here we want an energy, we want um, to catch. Of course, we need to catch these basic proportions, but don't focus too much on, on the perfection of your sketch. Okay, now I want to add uh, my black liner. I will outline this nice pillow. Maybe I will add some pattern to it. Let's say that it will have some triangulars on it. And of course our Ims chair. And let me know if you have in your house an Ims chair because <laughs> right now while I am recording this live stream I'm sitting exactly on this Ims chair. Even though it's not yellow. Uh, but it's a white Eames chair and at the very end of live stream I can show you <laughs> my Eames chair. So we show its legs. They are wooden. I really love this nice and simple design. We can slightly work on this ovals, maybe on the bottle, here and there. Also we can show this lamp. And I think I'm ready to add black marker. So let's say we have this pattern, triangular pattern here. And we don't want to overdo it, so let it be simple and quick. Nice bold line here. Yes, in my opinion, sketching should be bold. Of course, you should know some basic perspective principles. For these purposes, <laughs> go to my website and register for my free perspective challenge. Also, you can read my book the sketch you can buy it on Amazon because I cover the uh, basics perspective basics as well so just go to Amazon and enter the sketch Olga Sorokina it's my name and you're good to go and for now I want a bit little bit of black here and there so let me see. Let's put some dynamic here. I want to strengthen these drop shadows from the chair, especially the upper part of it. Strengthen it here. Make a nice background. And I can put an extra layer. Here. And finally, let it dry a little bit before putting white pastel pencil, because it will work only on dry paper. We can, for example, use our pencil to 
work a little bit with this wooden texture in the background we can darken shadow here a little bit and here from drop shadow from the pillow maybe some nice accents on the lamp and on the bottles and yes I think it's dry enough to put final strokes I this one is still a little bit wet so never hurry <laughs> Put it here and at the very end we can put our signature Olga Sorokina and if you don't know yet I have uh, not only free perspective challenge but I have paid video courses for beginners and advanced in interior design drawing so head over to my website Olga Art 888 and check the program of my base course for beginners in interior design drawing with markers and as I promised you guys I will show you my inks here so here you go <laughs> this is exactly the chair that I've been sitting in and at the same time I've been drawing it so if you have any questions please let me check them Hi everybody! Hi guys! Thank you so much for, join, for joining my live stream here on Instagram and I can't wait to see your drawings. Please put this uh, hashtag uh, Sarokina students so I can check your drawings. Alright and have a great day everybody! Bye for now!